Hello, good morning or good afternoon whenever you're watching this video. Um, so this was a leg session, this was a Saturday. I did do legs in the week, but unfortunately I wanted to puke my absolute guts up. Um, still to no idea as to why. Um, I had a banana before I trained. I reckon the potassium got to my stomach too much quickly and uh, didn't really agree with my stomach. So I did legs once again. Uh, on that Saturday but this session was fucking unreal the pub was amazing the session went really really good um, I was able to lift quite heavy um, ish to an extent where time was under tension still and uh, felt really really good at the end of the session to be fair um, I do have one more week left of the maintenance phase before going into diet phase um, as you guys would have seen in the last video I did put I've got one month left of training. Fortunately, that is true. Um, I'm having my left toenail removed on my big toe on my left foot. Um, now it's got to come off, unfortunately. Um, shit happens. Ingrown toenails are genetic and in the family, unfortunately. So I've got to make most of my training now up until the 24th of October, which is when I'm having my foot done. And then my training will have to stop for a while, which is quite depressing. So this was my second set. I believe I added 20 kilos or 10 kilos aside. Um, the machine weighed alone 15 kilos, which wasn't that bad to be honest. Um, the pendulum was taken for quite a while, so I stuck out and used this machine. So, so glad I did. Guys, if you're scared to try a new machine, try a new machine out, because I bet you any money you won't regret it. Um, there was another machine I did want to do, but I was too pussy to try, unfortunately. Um, needs must. But yeah, this was absolutely really good and I really, really felt this in my quads, my ass, my bunda, you name it. But yeah, this was really, really, really nice. As I have on my t-shirt, is don't skip leg day for my protein. Anything my protein, use the link in the description box down below. Helps your boy out, honestly. Um, helps me grow a little bit stronger.
wasn't in my workout, but I did want to do just a couple of sets, just to just to add it in, really. Um, I do really like this exercise, to be fair, but I weren't feeling too stretchy. As you can see, I'm not going out wide enough. Um, this machine's a little bit different to the one I use commentary, um, but this one is just as good. I am been getting a little bit of pain in the side of my legs and then a little bit of my butt. Um, but I think it's because I don't stretch enough, to be honest. Um, so I think tip it next time when I do this machine, stretch first. Really, really stretch. So it doesn't hurt so much the next time. So I just wanted to do some uh, pendulum squats towards the end of my session. I kid you not, my knees were shaking. But just wanted to practice um, get doing these squats, uh, consistent reps, rather than stopping, starting, stopping, starting. So I did this set, and this was just 30 kg alone um, with just the machine. And then the next clip that you'll see, um, it was 40 kg. Um, only added two fires on because like I said I was literally knackered by the end of the session um, and I just wanted to really practice on my reps and really get a, a really nice pump at the end. I feel like my quads are growing but we still can't see them unfortunately so rest in peace to my quads. So yes this one is 40kg, just added two fives to the side. Um, again it was just to have a little finisher at the end of my session. 
um, just consistent reps and just really finish off the session quite nicely. Um, but you guys would have seen the title of the last video. Um, I've got one month left of training. All shall be explained in the next video. Um, so bear with me for now. And then I shall explain what's going to be happening and when I'm not training for a couple of weeks. If you did enjoy, please smash that button. Please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.